Hi, I'm Paul Heaney, Editorial Director with Fluid Power World. And I'm Mary Gannon, Managing Editor. Mary, what do you think is probably one of the most important pieces in a fluid power system? That's a tough call, Paul. But without good seals, your system can easily leak and experience ingress contamination, so my vote goes for the O-ring. I have to agree. These simple donut-shaped rings, well, technically they're called toroids, are probably the most common fluid power seals. They're made by the billions, by manufacturers all around the world, and they prevent leaks in everything from pumps and valves to cylinders and connectors. Like all O-rings, these samples we have here from Trelleborg Sealing Solutions handle both static and dynamic operations and pneumatic and hydraulic applications. These samples are on the uh, smaller end of the size scale as O-rings can range in size anywhere from a fraction of an inch in diameter to several meters across. Like all O-rings, they feature a circular cross-section. They're typically made of elastomers like Buna-N, neoprene, or silicone, as most of these Trelleborg designs are made of. But they also come in plastics like PTFE, metals, and other materials. And that, folks, are O-rings in a nutshell. Stay tuned for part two of this series when Mary and I are going to talk a little bit more about exactly how O-rings work. And as always, visit www.fluidpowerworld.com for more videos, and thanks for watching.